Yo, we got a Rogue Demon update, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get straight into the Rogue Demon update. So first and foremost, <clears throat> we have a new move and a revamped ability. Wow, wait, hold up. Pause. We have more than just everything. What? Okay, so this is a double evasive. Or no, 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 no. Okay. So, Pot Escape has three charges. The ability will only act as an evasive if you have all three charges. So, I'm not sure what the other two charges are meant for, if it only works if you have full charges. Either way, they added a new ability called Octopus Barrage, which I have no idea. Let me turn up the volume really quickly. Uh, full screen. I actually think that goes hard. Hold up. That actually goes hard. Pause. Hold up. Oh, you hold it. So I'm pretty sure you could probably use this as a combo extender. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let me set the cooldown to zero. Let me set the cooldown to zero real quick. I messed up a little bit. What? Why is it not letting me do full M1? Let me try again. And the cooldown's too long. You can cancel it. Okay, so maybe we should try playing without return. Let me try that. All right, we messed up there. Oh my gosh, we keep messing up. Mmm, it's hard. We might be able to do it. Let me try. Hmm. Maybe if it had like a better move, maybe the alt would be something that could be used for it. Because like the thing is, the reason why you can't do it is because look. When you activate the ability, like you toggle it again, you jump in the air. It forcibly jumps you in the air, making it harder to instantly M1. You have to land first. See, because look at that timing that it takes for you to land. That's devastating. That timing is the reason why it can't be used as a combo extender, in my opinion. Let me see. Hmm. I need like a player. It'd be better to do it with a player testing. But yeah, this is definitely an interesting, like it, it's kind of like, and they also made Tamari fu uh, free. We'll make the, another video on that. But like, I'm, I'm more interested in, in this, in the combat. So let's go ahead and, okay, you obviously, my bad. Yeah, that, that m one is hard to do. It might be better to just do one in one. Hold on, we're gonna do a return of sword real quick. And then we're gonna set this cooldown to two. My bad, I'm trolling. <clears throat> Man, I don't know how long. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it just wouldn't work. 
Well, I think that wraps up Gyoko update, honestly. Man, it's a good ability, though. I wonder how much... I'm not sure how much damage it does, but I'm definitely going to make a combo short. So just pay attention to the shorts. You'll know all the damage and stuff. But that is the combo. You guys can let me know in the comments and stuff like that. Um, honestly, I actually think that this is fire. Like, no, no, no disrespect. I actually think it's fire. Like, I actually think this is like the VFX. I mean, it, it could have been done a little bit better, like the placement, but it actually goes pretty hard. It goes pretty hard. I definitely like the tentacles. Like, that's actually a super cool feature. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Yoko, peace out.